Hello everyone. In this tutorial, I will show you how to download and install Eclipse IDE on your Windows 10 operating system. IDE is nothing but integrated development environment. Eclipse IDE is famous for our Java integrated development environment. It is mostly used for developing applications using Java, Python, C and C++. Okay. Instead of waiting, let's start. Go to the browser, enter Eclipse IDE, click the first link. Here you can see the download button. Click download. Again, click download here. Let's wait to complete. After it gets downloaded, double click the installer. And this Eclipse installer window will open up in few seconds. Here you can choose which language you prefer to use on Eclipse. I wanted to use Eclipse for developing my Java program. So I will go with the first option. If you want, you can choose any of uh, any of the options below here, you know, either you want, if you want, you can choose enterprise Java or C++ or any, any other PHP developers, anything. So I will choose the first option, which is Eclipse IDE for Java developers. Here you can see the Java version installed on your machine and also the installation folder. You have to make sure the, where you are, where you are going to install your Eclipse. Click install. Click launch here. Here you have to select directory as workspace. So this will be the locations where all your project will be saved on your windows. If you don't want to change this location, just leave as default and you can check this option. Use this as default and do not ask again. Uh, again. I don't want this option. So click launch. If you will launch first time, you will see the welcome window. I already opened this one. That's the reason I am not. I don't see the. Uh, there is no welcome screen here. Now we can create simple Java application using Eclipse. So go to the file, click New, Java Project. Here the project name I am going to give. Hello world. This one is the location of the project where it will be saved. By default, it will be saved in the directory you have already chosen. So now, since use an execution environment JRE, I have already installed Java SE 11 on Windows. In your case, it will show you different version depending upon what Java version you have installed on your Windows. As I will leave this as default. So uh, second option is um, project layout. Project layout here use project folder, a root for sources and a class. Second option is create separate folder to sources and class files. I will leave this also as default and then click next here. And this will be the project structure. Click finish here. Here, check the uh, generate comments. This one, click create. Here you can see the Hello World project. Now I just want to create a simple Hello World.java program. So I will just delete the module info Java, Java file. Now here inside the source, I will create the Java class, new class. Here name, the class name is Hello World.
if you want you can create the new uh, uh, you can create the package here otherwise if you if you will not create any package it will okay, just a default one this will be a public class and i want to create public static void main inside the class so i will check this option also and then click finish this will create a class for me and inside this class there is a public static void main method also created which is the main entry point let's print something using system.out.println shortcut for system.out.println is sys o control plus space this is the shortcut way for the system.out.println in order to print any string you have to enclose it within double quotes let's print hello world to print hello world right click run as java application you can see hello world so in this video we saw how to install eclipse in windows 10 and also how to create a java project and how to create java class and how to run run them thank you for watching